Good afternoon. It's Sunday, July 25th. Time for the Saginaw Bay Walleye Fishing Report from Thumbs Up Charter Services. Well, this week we did go out. Um, we did search on Wednesday and Thursday, uh, extensive searches <laughs> for walleye. Not happening. If you saw our last report, things were really starting to slow down from a week ago, and now they're pretty much to a halt. We're in the area from North Island out to the outer Saginaw Bay, Lake Huron. It's a pretty vast area. If we're going to get fish this time of year, it's going to be at the Charities. It's going to be in that area. Cooler water temperatures, fish migrate there. Um, we had no such luck. We started taking a lot of water temperature readings again. At some points around uh, Sam Point, we were 80 degrees at the surface, measuring it about three foot down, and at the bottom we were like at 78. It's incredibly warm. Everywhere we checked, even out to Oak Point and uh, the Charities in the deep water, sorry there's a mosquito here, deep water areas, same thing, just a couple of degrees cooler. So what's happened here is we saw this last year in August, uh, right in the middle of August, the fish turned off and they went out to the main lake and they stayed out, they went way out. They went to the deep, deep water. We're talking 80, 100, 120 feet area um, for cooler temperatures. It's just not walleye preferred. In fact, it's like bath water. They don't like it when it gets to 80 degrees. There's less suspended oxygen in the water. They get sluggish. You know, it's kind of like you after a big meal or me after a big meal, you just don't feel good, right? So what are you gonna do? You know, on a hot day, you're gonna turn the air conditioner on. Well, for a walleye, that's to go out into cooler water. And um, we will say this, that there's steelhead out there, okay, on those deeper water and things, and, and those can be caught if you go out that way. But really from a standpoint from where we're located, um, that's, you know, a fair whack of a distance to get out there. So what we're going to do in the next couple weeks here is we're gonna suspend our weekly fishing report. We're gonna continue to go out and look and when we find something, um, hopefully positive, we'll come back and give you an update. What we need, I hate to say it, middle of August, it's 88 degrees day, but we need a strong cold front and we need a sustained maybe week or so of temperature, cooling temperatures along with a cooling rain. We got a lot of rain here yesterday, had more tornadoes up on the top of the thumb. I mean, what is the chances of that? That's some strange weather. I mean, the tip of the thumb, maybe sees a tornado every 10 to 15 years, and they had two of them again up there yesterday, and they just had one six weeks ago. Strange, strange stuff, but, and strange, strange fishing. I guess they go hand in hand. But we will continue to monitor that situation and bring something back to you once we know. I think what we're gonna do in the meantime, we're gonna take a little break. We've been going all year. We've been going since May 1st. We've had a fantastic year. I wanna thank every, every one of our customers, if somebody's watching this, Thank you so much for a great season so far. Um, compared to last year with COVID, um, and the very few charters, very, very few charters we were allowed to run, um, this year has been fantastic. So it doesn't hurt to take a little break. We're gonna work on the Ambrose behind us, okay? And we got more and more videos coming out. In fact, we were working on the transmit today. There's gonna be some fantastic videos of Thumbs Up Charter Services behind the scenes coming out showing you all the work we're doing. Because we wanna get this boat going by next May to go out of Grindstone City or Harbor Beach. We're, we're figuring which place to put this thing. And um, that way, if this happens again, we'll take you steelhead fishing. And that's a lot of fun. But I digress. We've never really taken you guys aboard the boat when we have customers out um, and showed you fishing, right? We've always done thumbs up charter service behind the scenes. There's a lot of reasons for that. When we get on the boat with the first mate and paying customers, we are busy. We are busy from the minute that we leave to the minute we come back because you're paying for it. Okay, and we're focusing on you and we're constantly tending lines and things, which makes it difficult to do some of these things. And I heard of GoPros and other things we can do, but then again, you know, it is a private charter and customers may or may not like that aspect of it as well, having themselves on one of our videos. So we've refrained from doing it. But I think what we're going to do is take a little hiatus here and we're going to go out um, the next couple of weeks and we're just gonna go out looking for the fish, but when we're there, we're gonna videotape for you guys. So we're gonna go through showing you how to set up bottom bouncers and set up planer boards and the different colors of the, 
of the uh, crawler harnesses and our nicknames for them. Uh, some of them are common nicknames, but we have our own for some of them too. And maybe you'll find that fun and interesting, okay? And uh, also, you know, using lead core line and going over what downriggers are used for in deeper water and all kinds of stuff. So I think we'll do hopefully maybe a couple videos here in early August that, that'll entertain in the wall of the action on fishing. And maybe that could replace our fishing report while we're waiting here a little bit. So with all that said, I wanna thank all of you this year for all the great charters that we have had. There will be more. We just need the weather to change for us. And you know, if we got any information and news that's going to come forward that you know we can provide to you guys and other anglers that watch us and we really appreciate everyone that does um you know we will get that to you as soon as we can so until then it's captain carl birdsight thumbs up charter surfaces visit us on the web at thumbsupcharter.com on google at thumbs up charter services in seawing or bayport towards bayport michigan or on facebook at thumbs up charter services and you know, um, it would be great on uh, YouTube or at Facebook if you would follow us or like us, whatever that stuff is. I'm not super internet guy, but, you know, that way you kind of keep abreast of what we're doing around here and keep tabs on Captain Carl because he's a pretty wild and crazy guy from time to time. We'll see you soon, folks. Take care. Have a good day.